Good morning and welcome to Fish and Friends. Today we have a rather pressing topic to discuss. That's right. A group of student comedians at Ohio State is banding together to push a liberal agenda, this time about tides. You heard it here, folks. This polarizing group called Fishbowl Improv is spreading fake news about the rising tides and causing alarm all across the Ohio State University. Right. Let's take a look at this rather disturbing clip of Fishbowl spreading liberal propaganda. You can see how this student is wearing blue, which is clearly a nod to the Democrats. And let's go ahead and take a close-up look on his raised hand there, clearly forming a semi-fist, signifying some form of revolt. My guess is that it has something to do with the democratically caused shutdown. I don't know about you, Brian, but I am truly disgusted. I mean, using a free comedy festival as bait to join their leftist sentiment? I couldn't agree more. When I was their age, my biggest concern was how I was going to get my hands on that new Journey album. No. And I don't mean to be crass here, but really, what can you joke about these days? Exactly. The other day I saw on the Twitter that the kids were offended by the itsy bitsy spider because the song Body Shames an Insect. Brian, that is rich, let me tell you. Everyone gets offended about everything. We actually have an exclusive clip of a fishbowl practice where you can see just how much they are pushing the liberal agenda. Take a look. All right, guys, what ideas do you have for Tide 6? We could offer free admission to everyone who comes. Oh, oh yeah! yeah. 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 Oh. Uh, I'm sorry, Bernie Sanders, is that you? <laughs> Looks like Fishbowl is doing everything in their power to promote liberal fairy tale ideas like free admission across campus. We actually conducted a poll and found that 90% of people don't even know what improv comedy is, and the other 10% hate it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that sounds about right. What a waste of student funding. Let's take a look at this angry student. Oh, yeah, there's actually a lot of student comedians on campus. They have that um, the Ties Festival coming up. I'm actually super excited for that. I hear they have like two all-female comedy groups, it's awesome. All right, now let's take a step back and decode that message. I mean, two, two all-female comedy groups. Exclusive much? And I'm sorry, I don't mean to dig too deeply, but do those kinds of groups even exist? <laughs> it's almost as... I'm going to stop you right there, Ainsley. Um, what's next, an all-female football team? <laughs> Not in my America. That is rich, Steve. Corporate bailout rich. Oh, we are getting our first caller of this morning. This is Ian Gray from Turning Point at Ohio State. Ian, you're on. Uh, hi, Fish and Friends. I just wanted to say that Fishbowl Improv is the worst comedy group on campus. And I am sick and tired of them using comedy as bait to lure students into their leftist propaganda. Ian, we're so glad you called. Can you tell us a little about your experience with Fishbowl at THE Ohio State University? Well, of course, the group called Fishbowl was having a festival called Tides. Just another stunt to spread fake news about so-called climate change. Last weekend, it snowed six inches in Ohio. What do they have to say about that? Excellent point, Ian. Keep doing the Lord's work. What a smart kid. Maybe there is some hope for students at Ohio State. As long as students learn to keep their heads in the books and their mouths shut. Let's make Tides attendance like youth voter turnout. Low and frowned upon. And remember, when in doubt, just deny. For Fox News, we're fishing friends. 